<laughs> Get him. Mom, like a crooked judge, these lips won't do justice to the sentences I'm about to give. But I stand before you today to testify that I never question your judgments. And I thank you for giving me life. 26 years of age, Mom, and I can't even begin to fathom nor explain the feelings of pain you must have endured when you birthed me. But considering we were connected, I can only assume that's the reason I cried. 26 years of age, and I can't even begin to fathom nor explain the feelings of pain you must have endured when you birthed me. And I thought in the cool the five times a day you metamorphosis into a prayer dress, leaving glitters of content with each step, catching flight before you gracefully set your feet to lay in the middle before God and back into mother before reasoning can even distinguish between fantasy or reality. And my mind tried hard to catch the transition between mother and wife at an early age, and I still can in my old age was here receiving like old times, but you know what I said the gift drop doesn't make the present, right, Mom? And the present is God's gift to a few. Well, if that's the case, Mom, God's greatest gift is you. And it's astonishing how these material wishes are on your head list, and the daily chores didn't diminish your commitment. But I worry I've strained you by your patience. Let you dry like the months following my breath. Made you carry burdens on your shoulders, heavier than the mountains of chores you took on daily. Humbled like the night, you reject the notion, but can't deny the evidence is written on your face and the way you walk. But you say, those trail of wrinkles across your face are rivers that once carried your happiness because your face flooded with so much joy you couldn't accommodate your smile. That you would sacrifice time, put a blade to its throat so you can spend an eternity with that smile. That hesitation in your step. You call it an intricate yet necessary dance between a mother and a child. Mm. Easy to learn, but hard to forget. Uh, I just wish that God gave me the gift to see your thoughts into color so I could paint the perfect picture of what you always wanted me to be. But we both know I'm not a visual artist, Mom, so accept these words in your place. Mm -hmm. And no, Mom, I swear I will never place you in a senior's home because I've seen your smile and that's my home. Yes. Uh -huh. my teachings as a map, but I know if they ever need a point of reference, they can come to you, because you always have been, and always will be, my legend. Yeah.